Hi, welcome to Corporate Training Today. In this video, we'll be discussing best workplace practices for better communication. We all have workplace frustrations and thoughts, sometimes bad thoughts, but in this video, I hope you take away best practices for better communication. Let's meet John. Hey John, what the f do you want? I was really hoping you could help me out with this project for a minute. Why the f are you even employed here if I'm just gonna keep doing your job for you? Why don't you go f***ing figure it out? Whoa! When a coworker asks for help while we're already busy, let's remember to reply with patience. Not like this. Try this instead. Uh, hey John? Yeah. I was really hoping you could help me out with this project. I'm having a really- Yeah, sure, I can help you out. Just let me finish up what I'm doing and I'll come right over. Hey man, can you cover my shift for me this evening? I really want to go to the movies with my friends and I've covered like four shifts in a row for you, so I was really hoping you could pick up the slack for me. Ah, uh, no, John, I, I can't cover your shifts tonight. I have to take care of a lot of things. I hate you, you stupid bitch! Hey, John, let's bring it down. You're up here right now. I need you to come down here. Hi. Can you please cover my shift for me tonight? I would like to go to the movies, and I've covered like four shifts in a row for you. So please, please just cover, cover for me tonight, please. No, John, I have to water my plants tonight, and then I have to feed my cats, and then I have to pull the drawbridge to the, to the curb, and then I have six hours of TV to watch. I can't cover your shift tonight. I'm going to be far too busy. I don't give a f about any of that. Can you please just help me out? Please. Can you please just help me? Please, I'm asking for help. I never ask you for anything. Please help me. In this scenario, John has completely lost his cool and probably won't be working here much longer. <laughs> Let's move on. Hey John, I noticed you hadn't sent those emails I asked you to send earlier. Oh yeah, did I? Okay. Well how about you take your f***ing emails and you shove them right in your ass. I know we're all busy with things, but if you could just send those emails that would really help everybody out. Oh yeah, I didn't send the emails on time. Uh, uh, just messing up again. John's always messing up. Great. How about you go send your own f***ing emails? I'm not your f***ing secretary. Go, go f***ing take care of yourself, okay? I'm tired of f***ing dealing with you. F*** yourself. Remember, when a coworker or an employer makes a critique, it's not a personal attack on you. They're simply trying to make the team better. Let's try that again, but have a little bit more patience. I think we can all take that away from this video, having a little bit more patience. Let's try that again, John. Hey, uh, John, real quick, sorry to bother you. It looks like you're busy there, but if you could just give me your attention for a second. How about you go kill yourself? Have a good day. Uh, you were supposed to send those emails earlier and you didn't. I'll, I'll get right on that and work on it. I'll work 10 times harder for you. So I'm gonna need you to stop whatever you're doing. Send the email and you can go back to whatever you're working on. Thanks a lot. Thanks. Communication is key. Go away. Emails are communication. Thanks for spending a little time with corporate training today. We hope this video educates you and brings your team a little closer together. Always remember the three T's of team. Teamwork, togetherness, and tickle time. Just kidding, the last T is try not to kill yourself. We know you hate your job and you hate your life and you have nothing to look forward to tomorrow, but just know that there are better days coming probably. We love you. And we'll see you in the next corporate training today video. Goodbye.